The overworld of Deepwoken is not your average C open world map. The entire world is set in darkness, with monsters that have ascended from the world below, and islands that are better off hidden in the darkness. We call this area the Void Sea, however, if there's darkness, there must be light. Five archipelagos scattered in the world, the light repelling the darkness, the luminance. The theory states that once all the luminants were together, but little by little, the void ate the areas in between, leaving massive voids in between. The civilizations living at that time had to come up with a solution, and so the lighthouses were created. Lightkeepers are special, they are born with the lightkeeping attunement. Only a few are born in each luminant, and most of them don't even know they have lightkeeping. Lightkeeping, like Shadowcast, worked in a different way. In my last video, I explained how Shadowcast worked. Well, light is exactly like that, but instead of shadow coming within the player, with lightkeepers, light comes within the player. They use this power to act as the light of the lighthouse. But why? Why are lighthouses so important? Do you remember the art I show in like all of my videos talking in the Luminant? Or maybe you've seen the art in Reddit. Well, those maps are fake. There's an error in them. Between Luminant and Luminant, there's not that space. There's much, much more space. To be exact, expeditions take months or weeks. Going to the Void Sea for a month doesn't sound like a good idea, does it? Well, lighthouses are there to light up the way and show you where you must go. To put into perspective how important lighthouses are, there was an era where there were no lightkeepers. Only two expeditions managed to not drown in the void. The Gremor migration, when Gremors exited the north, but they used the compass they have in their head and used that to not get lost in the void sea. And the legendary Petra, the only boat that has survived to the void sea without the Lightkeeper's blessing. To find out more about Lightkeepers, we have to go deep into Eresia, higher Eresia where we will find the hidden city. Nimea, an NPC, had a childhood friend that was born a lightkeeper. That friend was taken away once they found out that she was a lightkeeper. Lightkeepers have a heavy price to pay. Lighting up the lighthouse means that one's consciousness is gone and they also reduce their lifespans. Most people know just that, that lighthouses are just to guide boats. But you see, that's half the truth, or maybe just the secondary effects. The real reason of lighthouses, their real purpose is not guiding boats. As you may already know, we in the world of Deepwoken have arrived late. The world is already ending, it's only a matter of time for the drowned gods to awaken and to finish up what they started in their sleep. Lighthouses repel the darkness, they fight it to some degree. A bright candle illuminating, a candle that burns weaker each time. The southern lighthouse has already fallen, it's only a matter of time for the rest. Just look at the name, Lightkeepers, the Keepers of the Light, the Keepers of the Luminant, the Keepers of Life.